video. I'm really sorry it's taken me so long to do it. Loads of people asked me to do fitness videos, so I thought I'm just going to go for it and just show you how I work my bum and thighs. So I hope you enjoy the video. So I'm going to start off with having some water just to keep me hydrated. I'm now going to start off with a really basic squat. It looks very simple, but it is still very effective. So I'm just turning to the side, and um, you don't have to do this, I'm just doing this to show you the technique. I'm keeping my stomach tight in. You really don't want to let your stomach fall at all. Um, you don't want to let your bum go anywhere past your knees. You want to really keep in that nice chair position when you go into your squat. And keeping the bum as toned as possible, tensing it as you go down. And when you come up. I'm also keeping my chest up. I'm not letting my chest droop forward and I'm keeping my eyes straight on in front of me. I'm now coming over to, this is actually a barbecue because I'm doing it outside, but you can use anything like a chair. Um, chair's probably more ideal for you if you're doing this inside. Um, I'm keeping my chest up once again. This is like a ballet move. I've done this in ballet. Um, when I was a dancer, this really, really toned my bums and legs a lot. So I'm keeping my chest up once again, my eye line straight. I'm not bringing my top half forward at all and I'm just lifting my leg behind me, keeping it as straight as possible. This is going to tone my bum a hell of a lot. So this is working on the bum more than the legs at the minute. And remembering to keep my stomach tight in as well. I really don't want to let that loose and I really don't want to forget about my stomach because this is also working my abs as well as my bum. So I'm doing about 15 on each leg. Um, I'm gonna do about 30 for each position that I do in this video. I might do a few more it's up to you, it's what works for you and until you feel worked. So I was just pulsating my leg, I'm doing going back to the normal um, leg raises, I'm now pulsating. This is just working my bum in a more extreme way. I'm now doing this to the side to show you once again. I've now got my weight. These are three kg on each hand. Um, I would normally do four or five, but because this is for all you guys to see, I'm using a three. It's totally up to you. You can use a one kg on each hand, or you can literally use no weight, but more resistance with the weights uh, works your body a lot more. So it's more effective. So these are lunges, these are going to be working my thighs and my bum at the same time. And with the weights you're also working your arms in this as well. So once again you're working kind of nearly all your body. Keeping the abs in once again, not forgetting that even though this is a bum and thighs video, you've still got to be aware of the rest of your body. Keeping my chest up, keeping my eyes forward. going to do about 15 on each leg once again. I've just gone to the side just to show you again. Making sure my legs are always parallel, that's so important. You don't want your legs to go wonky, you don't want your knees to be falling in different directions. 
you need to be aware that this is a lunge and it is working your bum as well as your thighs but you still need to be aware of your knees. So I'm coming on all fours in a tabletop position and I'm doing a similar leg raise to the one where I was with near the barbecue. This is actually a bit harder, I find, and more effective. I call this the donkey kick. Um, I got this from Gillian Michaels. It is very, very effective. Literally just raising your leg as high as you can. The higher you raise your leg, the more you're working your bum. This is working the glutes more than the thighs. And I'm just gonna change my leg. At this point, I'm starting to get a little bit sweaty, which is good, it means you work. In this position, again, it's really easy just to let your stomach drop, um, but keeping it tense as well, keeping it sucked in. Um, not too much, but just keeping it, making sure you're aware of your stomach is so important in this position. It's very easy to let it go. Making sure that my legs and my arms are all parallel. And I'm keeping my head forward. Changing leg again. This is where I'm pulsating, similar to where I went done with the barbecue, but I'm pulsating in this position is more effective. You should really start feeling it by this point. Your bum and your leg should really be worked. And I'm pulsating on the other leg. This will really, really work your bum. Thank you for watching the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see any more fitness videos like this, then just let me know down below or wherever. Um, make sure you're drinking lots of, lots of water. I'm drinking Evian. Um, and yes, um, my jacket I'll put in the down bar where that's from. Um, so check that out. Follow me on Twitter, which is Danny with an I underscore Christina. Instagram, Danny and Christina, and Tumblr, Danny and Christina with two A's on Christina. I'm sorry, that's a mouthful. Um, Yes, I'm sweating, um, you, and if you're sweating, that's good. It means you've worked. Okay, thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.